name is Julie Wood, and I'm first deputy press secretary to the mayor. Uh, and I also manage the digital content for the mayor's office, so the Twitter account and also the Instagram account. We joined in January of 2012 with zero followers, and now we have 28,000. The Flickr account is great. It's sort of the official portraits and things like that, and it doesn't give you what Instagram does, which is the opportunity to, to edit the photos and make them seem interesting and cool and use different colors and filters and um, the things that make Instagram really compelling, I think. The Instagram photos that do the best, um, that get the most likes, are actually photos of New York City, not photos necessarily of the mayor or including the mayor. We're so lucky to live in such a beautiful city that has so many great things to look at and see. And every time I take a photo of the skyline or um, looking sort of down an avenue or, you know, some of our more famous landmarks like the Empire State Building or the Chrysler Building or the 9-11 Memorial, I always get a lot of likes. The photo that I think has the most likes is a photo of the 9-11 Memorial from this year's 9-11 um, ceremony. It's a photo, I think, of the South Pool um, from the corner. And that's just such an easy place to photograph because it's so beautiful and it's really well set up um, for images like that. There's some recent data showing that there are even more daily users on Instagram than there are on Twitter. It's important to be um, visually, to have something visually compelling. So if your agency does anything that's sort of out um, in New York City on sort of the street level, then you're gonna have great photos. It's not a platform to you know, explain complicated policy decisions or controversial stuff, and it's really just more fun, creative, and positive. It's easy, you know, it just, it doesn't take very long at all. So I think it's something that everyone can fit into their schedule.